June 19th, 2017. We are doing something very cool today. The boat is hooked onto the truck. Rods are loaded, gears ready. We are on our way to Rice Lake to meet up with Jay. He is a huge fan of the Fear Fishing blog via YouTube. He's from Pennsylvania. He's up at Rice Lake spending a week here fishing. We're gonna go find out more. But basically, I met Jay through the vlog and now we're going fishing. We are here, beautiful Harris Boat Works on the shores of Rice Lake. You guys check this out, I was running late. That's how you get your rods ready in the morning. You grab a handful and you throw the strap over it. J-Man. How much, dude? How are you? Doing well, how are you? Big fan of the vlog? Yeah, absolutely. From Pennsylvania? Yep, Pittsburgh. How you feel about the Pens win? Loving it. Good boy. We're gonna go out there, we're gonna get some fish. How's the fishing been so far? Not too bad, not too bad, pretty good. Well, hopefully we're gonna step it up. This will be awfully embarrassing if we don't get anything. <laughs> yeah, definitely, <laughs> definitely. All right, boat's ready. Rods are out of the way, look at that. Lots of deck space. J-Man, you ready to do this? I'm ready. Let's go catch some fish. Sounds good to me. All right, you're good to go, man. Soul child, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yo, a soul child with the hip hop shit. Physically and lyrically, I tend to do pop shit. But part of me miss if stardom be a part of the twist. They started in this, similar to gargling piss. Quite nasty, cruising in the whip in the V. It's like taffy, assuming it, presuming it's me. You like daffy, duck down, hitting the ground. My style has gotta be some nature, how we sit in your town. Sooner than later, productive, I'm assuming you hate us. I'm perfection with the blessing, I'm pursuing you later. Presuming I'm greater, my financial status ain't diddy. You act as a diddy, best believe the baddest is with me. Not yet though, lyrically, my brain is a plane. I got a jet flow, cause all my shit go over your brain. My mic wild, true with the truck in the days. My lifestyle is like blue, cause I'm stuck in my ways. Take your time, so you fall back, fall back. Yeah. I'm on your mind, I know you feel that buzz, feel that buzz. We keep it rockin', you can be my friend And yeah. we can do it again, and yeah. we can do it again I said, so take your time, so you fall back, fall back love. I'm on your mind, I know you feel that buzz, feel that buzz. We keep it rockin', you can be my friend And yeah. we can do it again, yeah. that's what I told you Raise your glass, hot toast to you Spanish Sadie, call me baby while she whipping Mercedes I'm listening ladies, cause you could be my queen on the throne See the devil peep the treble while he peeping my tone On the quest to be the best, see nothing less in my vision Shorty dressed to be the best, it's like the text that I'm spitting Like a gift and a curse, see I spit till it hurts Flow be quenching your thirst, and throw that bitch in reverse Lyrically I'm attacking, hit a time with the mackin' So the song that I'm rapping, hit already with platinum Take a plaque from the future, take it back to a loser so If the flow is a PC the Mac will reboot you, get it? I ain't here for the beef shit, the peep shit Niggas in my city don't want it, they on some peace shit See I'm the present, you the past and you're boring in I'm the future, motherfuckers get the lorry in So take your time, shorty, fall back, love uh, I'm on your mind, I know you feel that buzz You keep it rockin', you can be my friend And we can do it again, and we can do it again I said, so take your time, shorty, fall back, love Fall back, love Yup, it's hot me You keep it rockin', you can be my friend All right, Jay, man. Pretty quiet Dude. day. We didn't do any talking, but we caught you caught a ton of fish. Unbelievable! It was so awesome. You were on fire so there awesome. for a while with the frog. Frogger, they were loving the frog. Go get your frog, and you can show everybody at home what you're throwing. Sure. sure. And I'll talk to these young men. Okay, guys. Sweet boat you have here. 
guys just hanging out? I need your name. Uh, I'm Jaden. I'm Jackson. I'm Josiah. You guys are big fishermen? Yeah. yeah. Yes. You watch the uh, Fear Fishing vlog? Yeah. Yeah? That's awesome. You're up here from Pennsylvania? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you enjoying yourselves? Yes. yes. You having fun? Yes. Yeah. Did you catch any fish? Oh, yeah. You guys need to start throwing this frog. This is what the big fish come on. You guys like the boat? Yeah. yeah. Sweet. Good work, dudes. All right, dude, introduce yourself. Hey, Joe Duda from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. What do you think of Rice Lake? Uh, I love it, come here every year. You're having a good time? Yeah. Oh you guys yeah. catch lots of fish today? Yeah, lots of walleye today, limited out. Nice, yep. that's awesome, dude. For anybody who uh, says the walleye bite on Rice Lake's over, it is obviously not. Hot this morning. We gotta find Jay and find, before he can show everybody out there that frog he was using. Maybe he was on fire. Okay, Jay, give us the secret. All right, Stanley Top Toad. This we, one's... we have to say that we're not sponsored by this in any we are, way. We are not sponsored by this. We are not getting them. paid to use this. I've never even heard of this Stanley Top Toad. It's a hollow, basically a hollow ball frog. What'd you hook it on? It's got no hooks, oh, man. Sorry. There are the hooks. Got the uh, the spin thing. Saves it. Keeps it in there. That's it, eh? Set like that. You These guys little gonna... paddle kickers just kick a nice up, nice you, little wake. You guys are gonna Bass have to send me crazy. some. Uh, send me some in the mail from Pennsylvania. There you go. All right, long day fishing. I have to hit the road, guys, from Pennsylvania. These guys are gonna spend the rest of the week catching fish. I might be able to come back and fish another day, but right now I am on the road. See you guys. All right, later. Have a good one. Bye, Bye guys. Made it home, picked the kids up. Whoo, that was a long day. It is hot. That was a real workout. Emma Quick, one word. How was school today? Great. That's really? Just great? Yep. My day was awesome. Extravagant. Ooh, big word. Ashton, one word. How was your day? Ooh. Good word. I had to rush off the lake to get the kids. Amber is visiting with her grandfather. Ashman, you coming? Ashton had a big class trip today and he is absolutely poop. What's up, everyone? Got the dinner on. I'm home. I'm in the, what is basically the fear fishing man cave outside, portable shed. That is a heck of a sunburn on my nose. Kids, wear sunscreen. I did not wear sunscreen today. I have too big of a nose not to wear sunscreen. Look at that. If that doesn't scream my fish, I don't know what uh, sunscreen I'm gonna have to start wearing it. Now, let's talk frog rods. That's what everybody wants to know. We hammered them on frogs today. No j j giant. We did get a pile of fish. Let's talk about my frog rod. Right here, high speed reel. Very important. Pick yourself up, seven one gear ratio reel. That way you can, you gotta keep your frog moving. I like to fish my frog fast, but when you set hook, you really need to get on top of that fish to get the fish up and haul them over those those weeds. The rod I'm using, 7.3, medium heavy. I like a softer rod, look at this, it's got, I don't know if you can see that, it's 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 stiff, but it's got a little give to it. This is honestly the least expensive rod I own. This rod retails anywhere, 64.99 Canadian. My favorite frog rod. I've used a pile of frog rods. This is by far my favorite one. Doesn't have to be expensive to catch fish, I'll tell you that much. Frog, I used a pile of frogs today. I will tell you, the best frog to use is the one you have confidence in. The frog Jay used, I would never have picked that off the shelf and chose that, and he caught a pile of fish on it. So, hollow bully frog. I did throw a buzz frog for a bit, no hits on it. I got some fish on the frog, but Jay, Jay was getting fish behind me that I'd gone over with the frog. So, find a frog, get confidence in it, use it a lot, you will catch big fish. 7.3, medium heavy, 50 pound, braided line, straight to the frog, high speed gear ratio reel, anything you can cast ultra far. When using your frog, the longer the cast, the better. To get it way back in the, the sticks, most of our hits came within the first four feet of the shoreline, being able to throw it way back in God's country will go a long way. Sunscreen needed, wow that's bad. I'm not even gonna show you this one. I'm here uploading a quick video to Facebook. And I came across a great question from Shant Nazir on YouTube. I butcher, if I butchered that name, I'm so sorry. The question was, which feeling is more addictive, shooting the bow or fighting a big fish? Well, Shan, I will tell you that they're both exciting. Now, shooting the bow is a lot of fun. Hunting is a whole new level of exciting for me. It's not that I like hunting more than fishing. It's just that I've been fishing for so long and I've caught I've caught a lot of big fish in my life. Hunting is so new and there's nothing quite like being that close to wild animals. I love fishing. I get pumped up for every fish I set hook on. But I guess, you know, the hunting thing is newer. It's more, you know, I'm not really sure of, you know, exactly what I'm getting 
getting into. Is it more fun or more exciting? I don't know if it's more, it's just different. It's, it's something everybody should experience even if you're not going to harvest an animal. It's pretty cool to be that close to a black bear or a white-tailed deer or an elk. Catching a five pound largemouth is pretty amazing. Catching a six pound smallmouth is absolutely awesome. Catching a big northern pike or watching a musky fall, it's the same kind of awesomeness, just different. I've caught a lot of big bass. I've caught a lot of big fish in my life, Chinooks. I haven't killed a lot of big animals, so it's just different, but one doesn't outweigh the other. If I, I don't know which I would pick. If I could only do one for the rest of my life, probably go fishing. All right, Ashman here is gonna help me wrap up the vlog. Can you do that? Yeah. Ra wrap up the vlog. Wrap up the vlog. What did you do today, Ash? Mm. School trip? Yes, and that was it. What I did you do to, on your school trip? I went to the movie theater and I went to the beach. I went fishing with my friend Jay from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, who is staying at Rice Lake. Man, did I ever get a sunburn. Look how much darker I am than Ash. Ash, let's see. Who's got the, oh, who's got the better tan? Daddy. I caught. I so got I, lighter. You are lighter. I caught some bass. Jay caught some bass. They are actually, him and his group of friends are having a tournament all week who catches the most fish. So hopefully I helped put Jay in the lead. He got his first muskie. He pounded fish on frogs. What else? Did we, and tonight we went for a walk with the dog. Dogs. Did you have a good day? Mm-hmm. Okay, we're gonna go make your lunch. Everybody out there, should they subscribe to the Fear Fishing YouTube channel? Yeah, every swap. Every video is about me, not daddy. It's about you? No, it's about daddy. It's about <laughs> daddy. <laughs> Just joking. <laughs> Anyway, from all of us here, tomorrow there will be no vlog. I have to go to a doctor's appointment in Oshawa. Daddy's got to see the doctor. Anything? Do you have any final thoughts? Anything you want to say to everybody? Good night, people, and subscribe. Bye-bye. We will see you soon.